welcome back. So I have the final Ultra Color Bomb wig to review for you guys here today. She's called Olina. I have her in the color DR Ginger Copper. And that's actually the same like the Reina and the Verona that I reviewed previously. If you haven't seen those two reviews, please go look at it. I'll link it at the end of this video. I'll link both of them. But uh, these are some of Ultra's newest color bomb units that just hit the market like literally just came out and I have it's basically a face framing split dye colors because you know color bomb collection is all about the colors it's all about the different colors that it comes in and these units that just came out these three that I reviewed today they all have a bunch of fall colors so if you're feeling like the festive season you're feeling the fall season I mean you can definitely get into it now this one here like I said it's a DR ginger copper and it's ginger on the bang area like it's heavy on the bang area the ginger color and it's slightly over here because it's like a face framing color because it's like like it says face framing split dye so um, it's a face framing color so you get the ginger around your face but it's just a little piece here and then the full bang here and then underneath you get the copper at the back and most of the copper over here as well now the ginger and the copper of course these colors go together um, the cherry and the burgundy of course that goes together the um what did I review first the caramel and the black of course that went together it just looks so good I really love it and it also comes in a sunflower blonde as well I'm interested in that one to be honest lately I've been getting into the blondes well I shouldn't say getting into it as if I personally cho chose it but lately I've been given a lot of blonde wigs to review and it's kind of starting to you know grow on me the different shades of blonde and stuff like that so I like that but let me show you the stock card this one has more for like a crimp deep wave type of feel what am I doing let me hold it up one second okay it's like a deep crimp wave type of look um but this is it this is on the inside of the stock card and here they show you some of the other colors that comes in the unit as well and at the back right here it shows you like the side and the back right here and i'll make sure to leave all the colors that it comes in in the description box down below i'll leave all of them and i'll also leave a link to the unit as well just in case you want to go purchase it the link will definitely be there um this is not one of my favorite styles to be honest but i mean it is still cute you guys know it came with the baby hairs at the front i showed you up front how i laid it down came with baby hairs parting space great straight out the box this wig like it literally takes you it will take you like a minute or two to actually put it on and hit the road like you know because once you put it on the only thing you would have to do if you don't like baby hairs then I would suggest you cut it out or flat iron it into the hair but if you do like baby hairs that's why I said it will take you like about two minutes or a minute just to lay the baby hairs down and that's it but you have to add powder to it but you don't have to customize it as you don't have to like tweeze it or anything it's not no big customizing you don't really have to cut down anything you know with these wigs and they're very soft the texture has like a very light yaki hair texture very soft has a great luster to it love the shine on it to be honest normally I don't really like the shine on the wigs but this one I actually really love the shine maybe it's because of the waves I kind of like the shine but yeah um if you like more of a natural hairline or more of a natural like baby hair situation and you might want to tweeze the baby hairs out a bit because it's not too I wouldn't say it's too thick but it's not natural looking like you know like really sparse like natural looking so you may want to like tweeze it out a bit I'll say it's like in between you know but it's pretty soft for the most part I haven't been getting any snags or anything like that but I did get a few strands and that's what all of them I got like strands from them and I wouldn't say that's because I cut the, the hair the lace close to the hairline because I don't think I mistakenly cut the lace too close to the hairline for all three of them but they do shed a bit so keep that in mind before you purchase but yeah if you want to purchase like I said the link will be in the description box down below 
you can definitely go choose your, um, your color and purchase from there and also the cap is super comfortable it's definitely big head friendly because it comes with that super stretchy mesh net material inside and it fits a smaller head size just as well okay so thank you guys so much for watching like subscribe follow us on all our social media accounts everything is at wig types and ask me questions in the comment section down below i will respond to you as soon as possible but thanks again for watching and i'll see you soon bye